This George? conference will now be recorded. Hello, everyone. Hello. Hello, hello. And welcome to our visit. My name is Queen Anna of Arendelle. And I'm Queen Elsa. And I am coming to you from the Enchanted Forest. Yes. So Elsa and I missed each other so much because we spend so much time apart now with me and my castle in Arendelle and her and her forest with the North Ultra people. So we decided to have this fun video chat with all of you. Are you ready to have some fun? All right, let's have some fun. How How is everything in the forest, Elsa? Oh, it's going good. Um, today, me and Gail went for a walk. You did? Yes. She was causing mischief, blowing lots of things over, but mm -hmm. it's okay. Oh, silly Gail. And how's no. everything? Are you planning your wedding? We are. I know Kristoff isn't here right now. He had to go visit Grandpavi because he says he has something special he wants to have at the wedding. I don't know what it is. I'm very excited. That sounds we, wonderful. We can't decide when to have it hmm. because we met in the summer. So that would be nice, but it was a snowstorm. So we don't know if it should be in winter. Well, you could always do it in summer and I can bring the snow. That's true. Oh, and we're going to talk to Oaken about getting special wedding favors. <laughs> he has great summer blowouts. So I'm sure yes, we'll get good. Big summer blowout. <laughs> All right, well, we have some stories we're gonna read to everybody. Elsa, would you like to go first or would you like me to go first? Oh, uh, you can go first, Anna. Okay. Tell your sister my, first. All right, my story that I want to read, can everybody see, is called The Very Fairy Princess by Julie Andrews and Emma Walton Hamilton. This is a fun story because both mother and daughter wrote it. Hey, can everybody see? Hi, I'm Geraldine. I'm a fairy princess. You may not believe me, but I can tell you that I am. I know that I'm a fairy princess because I feel it inside. A sparkly feeling of just knowing in my heart. Also, I do everything that fairy princesses do. The first thing I do when I wake up in the morning is put on my crown. That's very important. That is. Fairy, fairy princesses are always presentable. You never know who you might bump into, even on the stairs. And for breakfast, I have fairy pancakes with extra fairy dust on top. Fairy princesses have very refined taste. Then it's time to choose my royal attire for the day. The big decision is which dress to wear, pink and white, pink and purple, pink and red, or just pink. And my brother Stuart says fairy princesses don't wear sneakers and don't have scabby knees. I say sneakers help me practice my flying skills, especially when we're late for the school bus and scabs are the price you pay. Fairy princesses are very practical. My best friend Delilah doesn't believe that I'm a fairy princess. I say you can be whatever you want to be. You just have to let your sparkle out. For instance, I tell her you sparkle when you play the trombone. Fairy princesses are very supportive. Flying is not allowed in my class. So at school, I hang my wings up in my cubby. Besides, they get squished in the morning meeting. My teacher, Miss Pym, says fairy princesses don't fidget or interrupt. But how else can you be on the lookout for problems to solve? Sometimes you have to speak up 
like when our class pet Houdini the hamster escapes. Fairy princesses know when to take charge. See, there he is escaping. He does that all the time. Daily hamster. My favorite classes are art and music. That's when I can really let my sparkle out. I use lots of glitter, sequins, and feathers when I paint. Sometimes there's just not enough space on the wall for my pictures. Fairy princesses like to keep extra gifts on hand for special occasions, like when grandma comes to visit. All fairy princesses love to sing. Once in a while, I get carried away. And Mr. Higginbottom reminds me there's only room for one conductor in the chorus. The absolute best time of the week is when I have ballet after school. I wear my fluffy tutu and twirl and whirl and leap light as a feather. Occasionally my crown gets in the way, but I'm working on that. Fairy princesses know that practice makes perfect. Back home, it's time for my fairy snack. Pink lemonade and sugar cookies with extra sprinkles, double yum. And then it's into the garden I go to attend to my royal duties, like rescuing frogs. You never know when one might be a prince. Building little houses for my fellow fairies and exercising my unicorn. Mom calls me in for my bath. She says fairy princesses don't have dirty fingernails, but I say it's the price you pay for having so many responsibilities. I have to remove my crown to shampoo my hair, but I make bubbles just to tide me over. Look, it's a bubble crown. Stuart, my brother, says fairy princesses shouldn't watch TV before they've done their homework. But I say even a fairy princess needs a break to keep her sparkle from sagging. Besides, how else can you keep up with the fairy news of the day? Daddy knows I'm a fairy princess. When he comes home from work, he always says, how's my little princess today? So that's all right. Being a fairy princess can be very demanding. Sometimes it's all I can do to stay awake through dinner. See, I get sleepy. Every princess needs lots of beauty sleep to recharge their sparkle. Daddy carries me up to bed. Mommy tucks me in. Sweet dreams, Jerry, they whisper from the door. You'll always be our very fairy princess. The end. Did you like that story? Yay. I loved it. All right, Elsa, your turn. Great, okay. So I'm very excited because I'm gonna read a book called Unicorn Day. Yay. So before I start, if everyone Take your finger, pretend you're a unicorn. <laughs> there we go, perfect. Okay, we are ready to read Unicorn Day. Hooray, it's Unicorn Day. Ah, look how pretty they are. <laughs> when the unicorns come out to play, they have three rules they must obey. Unicorn Day rules. Rule number one, show off your horn and be proud to be a unicorn. Rule number two, fluff up that hair. Make sure it's groomed and styled with flair. And rule number three, have fun, fun, fun. That's the most important rule of all. Mm -hmm. In the woods where tall trees sway, they sing the song of Unicorn Day. Sunshine flowers, fairy wings, today's a day for joyful things. Nay, 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 dance and play. Happy Unicorn Day. Ooh. Ooh. 
They kick their hooves, they jump and cheer, and sparkly butterflies flutter near. Wow! They slide on rainbows in the air and love to braid each other's hair. Ooh! Maybe I can get a unicorn to help me braid mine. Yes! <laughs> me too, me too! Maybe we'll have one over when we're able to. Yay! They point their horns up as they fly and cupcakes rain down from the sky. Then after they have had a bite, it's time to have, oh, what are they gonna have? Oh. <gasps> a glitter fight! Glitter fight? Wow! Sounds fun. Uh-oh, that's not a unicorn. That's a horse. Oh, he looks sad. He does. He turns around to leave, of course. His horn's not real, it's just pretend. But they don't want to lose a friend. They tie the horn back on his head oh, and give the horse a hug instead. Yay! Then it's back to fun, fun, fun. That's the most important one. Mm -hmm. They march together, tall and proud, and soon, let's see, have you hugged a unicorn today? Yay for unicorn day. Soon some more friends join the crowd. Ooh. Wow, that's a lot of friends. That is a lot of friends, and they all look very pretty. Clip, clip, clop. They trot along as everybody sings. Cupcakes, sprinkles, cherry tarts. Twilight twinkles, glowing hearts. Sunshine flowers, fairy wings. Today's a day for joyful things. Nay, 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 dance and play. And see Daddy's happy, happy unicorn day. Yay! That was wonderful! I had fun being a unicorn. Very exciting. What should we do next? Hmm. Well, I don't know if everyone would want to play, but maybe we can play charades like we used to. I love that idea. Yes. You all want to play charades with us? Mm -mm. Awesome. Okay. Let's go. Myself and Anna will act them out, and what I'm going to do. We'll we'll pretend to do something, and then you guys can yell out what you think we're doing. Okay. All right. So let me. I'm ready. ready. All righty. Can we put the Am camera I... back on? They're done. <laughs> Let's see. Do you want to go first, Elsa? Yes. Okay. All right. How about, okay, I got one, ready? Uh, uh, tree, um, 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 driving, um. Swimming. Swimming, yes, that's it. No, you got it. Good job. Hit me next? Yes. Okay. Mm. Okay, ready? Brush your teeth. Brush your teeth, that's right. Mate, you're a genius. <laughs> Let's see, hmm. How about, I got one, ready? Ooh, um, 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 flying? Um, no go. No. She's throwing, she's throwing, 
She's hitting me something. I don't know if you're supposed what to. What is she playing? I'm playing a game. She's playing a game. She's throwing and she's hitting something. Baseball? It's. Oh, yay! Baseball, yes. Okay, okay. Perfect. My turn. Um, okay, ready? Maybe an animal? Monster. What do we What'd she say? Monster. A monster? Not a monster. That's a good guess. Mm. Maybe something. Rosie. There's a lot of types of fish, so I don't really know which one it is. It's a fish! You got it! <laughs> it is! Oh, it is! <laughs> you got fish! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> that was so exciting! That was a lot of fun! Do you want to try our craft? Yes. Okay. Does everybody have a piece of paper or a crayon or a marker? Yep. I drew a picture. You want to see my picture I made? And you're going to help me make another one? So I drew a castle. Oh, and yours came out beautiful. No, not a coloring book. No, no. Oh, yes. I love that you edited all off. I know. Olaf helped me. He helped me draw himself. You can watch him. Don't touch. You want to learn how to draw a tiger like this? I'm going to add me. I'm going to add me. Here, you want to hear. I'm not sure if I can draw all that. Take either your crayon or your marker. Let's see, what hey, color should I use? Hmm. I'm going to use a blue marker. Ooh. Is it blue like my dress? It is blue like your dress. That's why I picked it. <laughs> I picked right, so like, a color that matches your cape. So take your hand like this and put it on your paper like that. And you're going to trace your hand. <laughs> Do 
Yeah, can you see? There's my hand. Did everybody do this part? I've got a hand. Let's see. Hold it up when you're all ready. Think Amelia's ready. I think so. Oh, we have another friend okay. who's ready. Perfect. And Amber, I think Amber's ready. Okay. All right. Now, the next part is you have to make the towers on your castle. What shape is this? Does anybody know what shape? Oh, I think everybody's oh. muted. <laughs> Silly Anna, that's okay. Oh, it's okay. Well, if you guessed triangle, you were right. <laughs> so you're gonna draw some triangles on the tops of your towers. And color okay. them in. I'm doing some blue triangles. Ooh, I picked purple. Ooh, that's very pretty. Let's see. Perfect. All right. On my yeah, there we go. There's my cat. Ooh, very nice. Beautiful. These are some very pretty castles. What do you think we should put on our castle next? Hmm. Well, you need to be able to get into the castle. Mm-hmm. Let's make a door. Okay. Make my door. Hmm. Find a round door. Do, do, do. I love to color. Me too. I'm going to do a nice big door so that Marshmallow can make his way in. Oh, that's a good idea. Ooh. My door has to be pretty big too, so Sven can get in with his big antlers. Oh yeah. Can't have him getting stuck again. He's it's happened before. We needed oh, to put in a new door. <laughs> All right, I drew a big door. Ooh. Very nice, everybody. I love them so far. Coming out so What close. else? Maybe we should put some windows on our castle. What do you think? I think we That's need windows. Good. Whoops, I dropped my castle. Silly Anna. <laughs> silly, silly Anna. Let's see. I like to look outside the window at the birds. Me too. Do you have all of the windows open? They, I do. I have the door open too. Because <laughs> I didn't know they did that anymore. That's so fun. <laughs> okay, I drew windows. Ooh. Very nice, everybody. Oh, wow. Looking Everyone. good so far, everyone. <laughs> good job. All right, now if you want, you could start to color your castle, whatever colors you want. Ooh. I'm gonna make my castle green. That's nice, green castle. 
Mm -hmm. color mine in it's like ah it, uh, it's a reddish color okay maybe i'll add some flags like we have them in arendelle Ooh, i like that idea the flag of arendelle will always fly yes it will we'll make sure mm -hmm. of that I'm making a rainbow castle. A, a rainbow, rainbow castle? That sounds very nice. Oh, I would love that. Can make it whatever colors you want. It could be many colors. Doesn't have to be just one. That's true. I'm gonna put flags on mine too, like Elsa. Yeah, I did little squiggly lines up top for my flags. Ooh. This is exciting. All right, there's mine. <gasps> That's beautiful. Thank you. Ooh, so nice. Oh. Wow. Wow, look at these beautiful castles. This one's mine. Beautiful. It would be so fun if we could invite everyone to the castle, but not right mm -hmm. now. We will soon. Or maybe they'll be able to invite us back to the library. Yes, I would love to go back to the library. Next time we'll bring Olaf and Kristoff too. Mm-hmm. What else could we add to our picture? Maybe a friend. Yes. Ooh, that is so nice. Did you draw Olaf too? Wow. wow. That's, That's amazing. A beautiful castle. He already has a friend at her castle. Mm-hmm. Love it. These are such great ones. Did I see them stay here? Yeah. Oh, Let's see. Oh, Amber's got her rainbow one. Oh, she does? Wow. Nope. Not that back one. <laughs> Good um, job, everyone. Let's see. I'm going to add a blue sun. Ooh, a blue sun. That's a cool idea. Love you. Bye-bye. Oh, oh, somebody you. leaving? Bye. Yeah, Bye, Amelia. Thank you, Bye. 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 Thanks for coming. You're welcome. <laughs> there we go. I added a sun and snowflakes because it's going to snow at my castle. Yeah, you can put your cowboy boots on. Oops, sorry. Very fun. Let's see. I'm almost done. I'm drawing. Good. Okay, I drew me. Wow! <laughs> I'm in front of my castle. <laughs> I can finish, you know, maybe later I'll add Kristoff and Sven. We have another fantastic castle. Mm -hmm. Oh, wow. All of our friends. Mm -hmm. Peace. 
Please. At the end, you can show them, okay? So much fun. Well, I think we're running out of time. So I just want to say thank you so much to everybody for coming and visiting with, uh, with me, Anna, and my sister Elsa. We had so much fun. Oh, that's beautiful. Everyone did such a good job today. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I hope we get to see you all again at the library really soon. And one Disney get. <laughs> Ooh. That's your song, Elsa. Yes, I love it. <laughs> Beautiful. We'll be back at the library in the seat. We'll all sing it together one day. Yes. Perfect. Alrighty. All right, say bye bye. Thank you all for joining. Thank you. Bye. Bye. Bye, bye everyone. Bye. Thanks, Anna. Thanks, bye. Elsa. Thanks for coming. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect.